Tongyuan or Tang Yuan simplified Chinese, Tang Yuan traditional Chinese, Tang Yuan pinyin, Tang Yuan, literally, soup ball, is a Chinese dessert made from glutinous rice flour mixed with a small amount of water to form balls and then either cooked and served in boiling water with fermented glutinous rice, or sweet syrup, sweet ginger syrup, for example, or deep fried. Tang Yuan can be either small or large, and filled or unfilled. They are traditionally eaten during Yuanshao or the Lantern Festival, but also served as a dessert on Chinese Wedding Day, Winter Solstice Festival Chinese, Dong Ji Pinyin, Dong Zi, and any occasions such as family reunion, because of a homophone for union simplified Chinese, Tuan Yuan traditional Chinese, Tuan Yuan Pinyin, Tuan Yuan. Historical development Topic. Name Historically, a number of different names were used to refer to this food. During the Yongle era of the Ming dynasty, the name was officially settled as Yuanshao derived from the Yuanshao festival, which is used in northern China. This name literally means, first evening, being the first full moon after Chinese New Year, which is always a new moon. In southern China, however, they are called Tongyuan. Legend has it that during Yuan Shikai's rule from 1912 to 1916, he disliked the name Yuanshao Yuan Shao because it sounded identical to remove Yuan, Yuan Shao and so he gave orders to change the name to Tongyuan. This new moniker literally means round balls in soup or round dumplings in soup. In the Hakka and Cantonese varieties of Chinese, Tongyuan is pronounced as Tong Rhen or Tong Jian. The term tangtuan Hakka, tong tun, Cantonese, tong tian, is not as commonly used in these varieties as tongyuan. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Geographical differences. This type of glutinous rice flour dumpling is eaten in both northern and southern China. Sweet fillings such as sugar, sesame, osmanthus flowers, sweet bean paste and sweetened tangerine peel are used. In the south, it is common to have tang yuan plain in a savory soup made with Chinese daikon, radish and home-made fish cake. Topic: <laughs> Cultural significance. For many Chinese families in mainland China as well as overseas, tongyuan is usually eaten together with family. The round shape of the balls and the bowls where they are served, come to symbolize the family togetherness. Ingredients <inaudible> 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 While tongyuan was originally a food eaten during festivals, it has become a dessert consumed year-round rather than simply a festival food. For instance, tongyuan is traditionally in white color. Yet, in order to cater to consumers' needs and changing tastes, dessert specialty shops create new flavors or colors of tongyuan by substituting the traditional filling with chocolate, mashed potato and pumpkin paste. Thus, tongyuan has already evolved into a dessert that is consumed by Chinese from time to time throughout the year and is no longer limited to festivals. In both filled and unfilled tongyuan, the main ingredient is glutinous rice flour. For filled tongyuan, the filling can be either sweet or savory. Northern variations mix sesame, peanuts, sweet bean paste and place them into bamboo baskets with rice flour, sprinkle water continuously on the rice flour to form the fillings and form round balls. Southern variations are typically larger, and are made by wrapping the filling into sticky rice flour wrapping and scrunching them into balls. Sweet fillings can be Chocolate paste softened butter mixed with cocoa powder and stirred until blended A piece of cut sugarcane rock candy Fruit preserves Sesame paste ground black sesame seeds mixed with sugar and lard the most common filling Red bean paste azuki bean paste Chopped peanuts or peanut butter and sugar. Topic: <inaudible> Serving. Tongyuan are first cooked in boiling water. Once cooked, savory-filled tongyuan are served in a clear soup broth, whilst sweet-filled tongyuan are served in a ginger-infused syrup. Nowadays, deep-fried tongyuan have gained popularity in southern part of China. 
Filled tongyuan are put into hot oil to make its surface crispy. Unfilled tongyuan are served as part of a sweet dessert soup known in Cantonese cuisine as tang shui, which literally means sugar water. Common types include red bean soup, black sesame soup, ginger and rock sugar, fermented glutinous rice, lao zhao or ju niang, sweet osmanthus and rock sugar. Topic: Availability. The most notable varieties come from Ningbo in Zhejiang province. However, they are traditionally eaten throughout China. Tongyuan have also come to be associated with the winter solstice and Chinese New Year in various regions. Today, the food is eaten all year round. Mass-produced Tongyuan are commonly found in the frozen food section of Asian supermarkets in China and overseas. Related dishes In Indonesia, an adapted version, called Wedong Rond Wedong in Javanese means beverages, and Rond means round ball, is one of the most popular comfort food during chill temperature that's been served in mild crushed and thin sliced ginger root soup with palm sugar, frequently added fragrant pandan leaves, crushed grounded peanuts, and the glutinous rice ball itself that usually red, green, or white colored and filled with crushed grounded peanuts and sugar. In a way, Weidong Rond is Javanese traditional beverage Weidong Jahe served with glutinous rice balls. In Myanmar, Burma, Mont Lan Ye Pa, is a traditional festive dish, served during Thingyan, and filled with pieces of jaggery and served with coconut shavings. In the Philippines, Jinatang Bilo Bilo is also served in coconut milk, and sometimes local produce such as plantains, saba, tapioca, and or sweet potatoes are also added in. In southern Vietnam, a similar dish, called Che Zoe Nook, is served in a mild, sweet liquid flavored with grated ginger root. In northern Vietnam, Bon Troy also called Bon Troy Nook and Bon Che are also very similar, with the latter being served with coconut milk. <laughs> See also